everyone, gather around. Chibi Maruko-chan is about to start. Episode, Maruko wants to be bitten by Shishime. Hey, it bites. That mother is just watching as her child gets bitten and she's smiling. You don't understand. It's considered very good luck if a child's head is bitten by the Shishimai. What? But why, Mom? Well, that's what the legend says. People say if you're bitten by one, you will have good health and you can lead a happy life. And they also say you'll be very smart. What? I can become smarter? Is that for real? Yes, it's for real. And to come to think of it, your sister was bitten at a festival some years ago. Yes, that's right. <laughs> come on now, Maruko. Let yourself get bitten. Look, honey, it's not scary. Oh, calm down, Maruko. Oh, oh. What? After you threw a tantrum and cried for hours, we left without you being bitten. Dear, you missed a great chance. Such a pity. Yes, you know, maybe if you'd been bitten by the Shishimai, you would have ended up a little bit smarter, little sister. What do you mean by that? Shishimai? I've never had my head bitten by one, and I've never seen the real thing. Neither have I, Boo. I thought not. Okay, so what will happen if your head is bitten by a Shishimai? You will become much smarter. What? That true, Boo? <laughs> uh -huh. Oh, Yamada, have you ever been bitten by... <laughs> Look, I'm an alien, Joe. <laughs> uh, it's so obvious that you haven't. No need to ask. Good morning. Good morning. Morning. Boo. Hey, Nagayama-kun, I have a very important question for you. Have you ever been bitten by a Shishimai? Huh? Yeah, I have. What? what? You really have? Mm. Although I was really little. Oh. Everyone, the school bell just rang. So frankly speaking, you should be seated quickly. Hey, Amaruo, quick question before class. Have you ever been bitten on the head by a Shishimai? Pardon me, a Shishimai? Frankly speaking, I certainly have. Really, you have? Yes, all the legends say that you will be very smart if your head is bitten by a Shishimai, you know. So when I was young, my mother took me everywhere to have my head bitten by a Shishimai. I had so many bites, I can't count them all. What? You had many bites? <laughs> Thanks to those bites, I was able to earn a perfect 100 points in yesterday's ultra hard math exam. <gasps> so then it's true, after all, a bite makes you smart, Boo. Yeah. I'm home. Well, good afternoon, Maruko. <sighs> What's the matter? You look so depressed. Grandpa, I believe that I wasted an amazing opportunity in my life. Huh? Although I had a precious, precious chance to meet a Shishime, I didn't let it bite me. A crucial mistake in my young life. A crucial mistake in your young life? I might have been a genius, a child prodigy by now, if my head had just been bitten by that Shishime. A genius? I kind of doubt that. Grandpa, I just have to have my head bitten by a Shishime. Tell me where I can go to meet one of them. Tell me, please. Uh, well, uh... We used to see it at the festivals, but it's been a while now, hasn't it? I think it used to be done by volunteers of the youth group. 
and for a long time the tradition was passed down from the older generation to the younger one. But times have changed so much, and there's hardly any volunteers anymore. Mm, that's right, so we only see Shishimai on TV nowadays. Oh, no way. Oh, Maruko, poor girl. She wants to meet a Shishimai so much, but I can't do anything about it. Oh, how annoying, how annoying. Oh. The next day. Speaking of the Shishimai, there used to be one in my neighborhood, I think. What? Are you serious? One in your neighborhood? Yes, there is a shrine there, and I saw it there often. The Kano san! <laughs> please let my grandchild see that Shishimai. You have to do it for me, please. But, but the Shishimai is just an old story. I hardly ever see it anymore, and well. What? Are you certain about that? Yes, I am. <sighs> Shishikuro san, are you. Uh... My granddaughter asked me about it, and she's desperate to see a Shishimai. Yet I have no idea who I should ask or where. I'm useless. Uh... <sighs> I see. Then why don't I ask at the shrine about it? Maybe they can help you. What? Do you really mean it? Yes, I do. You've saved me. Thank oh, you. Uh... Thank you, Nakano san. Oh, sure. <laughs> Please, you must have another sweet bun no. now. Why don't you take the whole box? What? Please don't hesitate. Just take uh, it. Please, go ahead. Please, please. Uh, uh, yay! Yay! I can finally see a Shishima! Yay! I'm very happy for you, Maruko. Once my head is bitten by one, I'll become super smart, and then I will win a Nobel Prize and take you on a super nice vacation abroad! My dear Maruko! What a grand dream it is. In the meantime, at Nakano's residence. What are you going to do about it? <laughs> Although you've borrowed the lion's head, there's no one who can be inside it. And what about the body? I can't help it. There isn't anyone who can play the part. I should be thankful to have the head. But doesn't the granddaughter of Sakura-san want to see the Shishimai dance to the music and all of that? I don't know how good it is to show only the head. <laughs> I'll go tell him it's not possible. What? I'll go return the sweets he gave me. That's not possible. You've eaten them all, remember, dear? <laughs> you said they were very delicious and sweet. Oh, I, I forgot. I'm in big trouble. What should I do? Oh, dear. The next day. This is my first time seeing an actual Shishimai. Yep, I'm excited too, Boo. <laughs> you know, I wonder what happened to Nakano-san. Grandpa, do you have the right music for it? Huh? Oh, yes, Nakano-san asked me to prepare the music, so I've got a tape for it. <laughs> huh? It isn't moving, Joe. I wonder what's wrong. Hey, dance for us, dance for us! Dance for us, dance for us, dance for us, dance for us! So embarrassing! I, I shouldn't have cut me at all! Bad idea! What's wrong? It's such a weird Shishimai. It's boring, Boo. Uh, what should I do? Shall I just leave? No! If I do that, it'll be more embarrassing! I want to see the Shishimai dance like it does on TV! Listen, Shishimai san, please, please, please dance for us! <laughs> dance for us! Dance for us! Dance for us! I can't hold them off! I should gather the courage to just do it! Huh? It moved! Uh -huh. This doesn't seem exciting. <laughs> huh? Sh -sh -sh uh -huh. my son, are you all right, sir? Uh -huh. Oh, uh -huh. oh uh -huh. my goodness! But Nakano son? Oh, I'm so embarrassed. <sighs> 
<laughs> no, I'm very sorry about this, kids. No, no. This was my fault. I asked you for such a troublesome favor. <laughs> well, I should really leave now. Huh? But I haven't huh? had my head bitten yet, Joe. Yamada. Yeah, <laughs> I want to be smart, sir. Please don't go, Joe. Please, yeah, I want to be smart, too, Boo. Please, please don't That's go. the reason I came here today, Boo. Please don't go. Yeah, I want to be smart, stay. too. Nakano-san, would you do us a great favor and bite the heads of these children before you go back home? Oh, well, I... Yeah, come on, please. 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 Before you go. Uh, thank you, sir. Bite my head, Boo. Please bite our heads, sir. I just want to be smart, Joe. Oh. <laughs> I shouldn't ruin their dreams. <laughs> 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 Booyah! <laughs> All right! <laughs> Thank you very much, Nikado san <laughs> Thank you very much! So, how about it? Now that you've done it once, would you like to start doing Shishimai? <laughs> Please just give me a break! <laughs> Thank, Thank you again, Nikado san <laughs> Thank you, Nikado san Thank you for helping and that's how Maruko and her friends had their heads bitten by a shishimai. However, whether they'll become smarter after this incident, no one knows for sure. In this episode, Maruko wishes that the New Year's holiday mood would linger. I'm home. <sighs> Going to school really exhausts me. It's best to keep myself warm with a kotatsu on a cold day like today. School is exhausting to you? You know the third term has just started, right? Hey, why don't we play Karuto cards? Or maybe we can play a board game. The New Year holiday is already over. Why don't you switch your mindset and put more effort into your studies for the third term, dear? That's right. You should put your energy into it at the beginning of the year, because I bet you'll slack off in the middle of the term anyway. It's only January, so it's still considered part of the New Year. Oh, Why doesn't anyone goodness. else understand that? What do I do that? with you and your lingering New Year holiday mood? You haven't exactly finished with it either. What? I've been over the holiday mood for days. Yeah? Then what about this snack? These are rice cakes from our New Year's meal. Uh, well, I, uh... It's 100% leftover food from the New Year's holidays. And on Sunday. Ah, uh, Tama-chan. Hey, would you like to come and play with me at the vacant lot today? It's such a nice day. I'm sorry, Maru-chan, but I really have to practice piano now. I've been relaxing for the whole New Year's holidays, so I have to work extra hard today. Oh, uh, I see. Yeah, well, all right then. Grandpa, let's play Karuta Kart. That's right. They've got a senior citizens club meeting. And only regular programs are on. I want something suitable for the New Year's holidays. This is no fun at all. The view in town's become dull very quickly. Just last week, it looked so lively and everyone was happy. Hi. <sighs> Looks like the New Year's holidays really are over until next year. Oh? Huh? What's that, a kite? <laughs> Mamaji! Butaro! Uh -huh. Oh, hello, Sakura. <sighs> it's great. Flying a kite is such a great holiday pastime. I'm glad that you boys love the New Year's holidays as much as I do and won't let it go. This kite isn't about mm. the holiday spirit. An uncle who I expected to get New Year's money from showed up today, so I finally got money to buy this kite. This kite is the latest model, Boo. It flies well, too, Boo. Let's play by flying kites during the New Year's holidays. Let's play by spinning tops in the white uh, snowy cold. Sakura, you're being really weird right now, Boo. <laughs> it's because I'm having so much fun right now. <laughs> hey, come on. It's my turn now, Boo. No, let me play a little longer. It's very windy, so be careful with it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> What do you think you're doing? I'm sorry! Move it! We've got to catch it! Move! <laughs> Come, Come back! back. <laughs> 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 
A little more, Boo. More to the right, Hamaji Boo. Ah! Yeah, uh, a little more. Just a little. You can do it. Get it, guys. We have to grab the tail. Okay, here I go. I got it. No way. I will never let Sakura fly my kite again. I know, I know. I'll just watch you guys fly. At least I can still enjoy the mood of the New Year's holiday. Huh? Uh -huh. They're having a bonfire, Boo! <laughs> <laughs> it's so warm! Huh? What's all this stuff? Decorations, pine trees, and tinsel? But why? Why are people burning these things? Oh. 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 Huh? Oh, no, you don't, Yamane! It's awful of you to think of burning that! Uh, Sakura! A New Year's bonfire? What is that? All the New Year's decorations are burnt, and we'll eat rice cakes baked by the fire. They say it will keep you healthy for the upcoming year. Really? I didn't know that tradition, Boo. Uh, you know I have a weak digestive system, so I thought I would be a tough man this year by eating a rice cake baked by the New Year's bonfire. Oh. I see. Did you bring anything else? Oh, yeah. If you burn your first calligraphy of the year, it will help you improve your handwriting. Apparently, it'll work better if the paper rises high up when you put it into the fire. My mom told me that. Really? I want to see that, Boo. Yeah, come on. Let's go burn it now. Okay, dokie. I'll do it. Burn! Oh, wow. It rose. It rose so high. That's awesome. I bet your writing will be good, Boo. You think so? I'll be so happy if it works. Look at that. Bye-bye. Bye-bye, New Year's holiday. Well, I wish the New Year's holidays would never, ever end. What? No, that's no good. Because huh? if the New Year's holiday doesn't end really soon, then I can't be a big brother. Yes, his mother is going to have a baby any time, and she's in the hospital waiting right now. He's been anxiously waiting for the New Year's holiday to be over so he can be a big brother. Yeah? That's right, and I'm staying at my grandma's house all by myself now. I am alone, but I won't cry, because I will be a big brother soon. That's so great! You're a big boy now. And you'll be a good big brother, Boo. We're giving away the rice cakes now. Please come and get one, everyone. Oh, the rice cakes. Come on, guys. Let's go and get one. Boo. <laughs> I guess it's true, then. The New Year's holiday really can't last forever and ever. Oh, Maru-chan. Oh, Grandpa Sasaki. What are you doing here at the bonfire? I came to collect the ashes. Scattering the ash of a New Year's bonfire around the house keeps all the evil away. Ah. Uh... Oh, my. You seem pretty down today, Maruko. Because I feel kind of sad today. The New Year's holiday was so much fun. But now I feel like everything is burnt and gone. Maru-chan. But you should know that not everything fun is in the New Year's holidays. What? Look at this cherry tree. All of its beautiful leaves are withered and gone. It's a completely bare tree now, but inside that rough trunk, its preparation for spring has begun. It's preparation for spring? Yes. It's been in a state of hibernation all through winter. Yet, when it gets warmer, it will bloom once again and entice us to gather around, saying, let's enjoy spring together. Remember last spring? Cherry blossom viewing parties. When summer comes, green leaves grow thickly from the branches. Cicadas will appear and chirp happily. And beautiful colored leaves signal the arrival of the autumn. Don't you have fun during those times? It makes a nice sound when I step on the fallen leaves. Yes. And then the cold winter arrives once again. That's how the seasons change, and we know that yet another new year will come around very soon. I see. That's true. I see your point. Fun is not only during the New Year's holidays. That's right, Maru-chan. You guys, you startled me! We're gonna grill this and then eat them! It looks delicious, Boo! It does. It looks like flowers that are blooming. 
It looks like the early arrival of spring. Mm. I wish for another Happy New Year's holiday next year. Oh boy, that rice cake was delicious. We almost lost the kite, but we got lucky, huh, Boo? You know, it's all thanks to me for letting the kite go. Let's not get carried away. <laughs> sorry, sorry. <laughs> well, I'm going home now. See you guys. Yeah, see you later. See you tomorrow, Boo. See you. I'm home. Hey, Grandpa, let's scatter this ash around our house later. Grandpa Sasaki told me that it would keep the evil away from our house. Oh, will it? Let's do it. Let's do it. Maruko, will you bring this cake to the living room, please? Wow. It looks like you've finally gotten rid of the New Year's holiday mood, Mom. Why do you say that? Because it's no longer rice cakes. Uh, yeah, uh, I guess so. <laughs> nope, the New Year's holiday mood is still lingering over Mom. <sighs> I watched the New Year's bonfire to see the New Year's holiday off, and it brought me energy. I will work so hard this year. Oh, yeah? I bet this won't last very long. Big Sis knows her well. It's good to see you so energetic. That's the spirit of Maruko. You're beaming more than usual. It's almost like you're blinding me. Tomozo spoils her, and that won't change this year either. Let me see. What shall I start with this year, huh? I feel like I can do anything at all right now. <laughs> well, if you got so much energy to spare, why don't you run around the neighborhood? You have a marathon race again this year, don't you? <laughs> A marathon running race? Yes, that's right. There will be a marathon race happening soon. Uh... All her energy is gone, and she is thrown into the deepest despair. Maruko wishes for the New Year's holidays to last forever after all. I hate 